channel so today i'm be making some cute little bunnies out of wood slices these were absolutely free to me i had everything on hand except one tiny little pearl so i guess if it could be like one dollar i'm gonna say that it was completely free for me to make um i was really excited i had my husband help me he used a scroll saw and i kind of did show some clips on how he did that as well just because I am just not gonna do it. And he can help me once in a great while, and that's okay. I don't think he minds helping like once every few months. So anyways, I'm gonna jump right in and show you how I made these. These were really, really quick and really, really easy, so I don't even know how long this video is gonna be. Probably me talking is gonna be longer than the whole video put together, because I almost just glued stuff. But they're so cute, so I gotta just show you anyways. So you are just gonna need a bunch of wood slices. I had big ones, I had medium-sized ones, and then I had smaller ones. And I don't know the sizes off of hand, but I'm sure you can always find something like this at Michael's and it would really be able to help you out um, as far as like the sizes go. But if you really do want the measurements, I can get those for you. But like I said, they came off a tree. So who's to say that's, you know, you'd get the same ones. But anyways, so this is how my husband cut the ears off for me. I just had extra wood slices and then we just kind of made a shape of an ear and he just took his scroll saw and just cut them I guess you just he just kind of cut around the edges and made them really perfect and beautiful and I was making wanted to make two of these bunnies so he had to cut me four of these ears but this is what it looks like and that's how it was done and then I took E6000 in hot glue and I took the big wood slice since that is going to be the body and then the medium sized one and just glued it right to the top and then the ears I glued to the back side and then the teeny tiny um, wood slices I just used as feet. So this was like really easy. It's really self-explanatory and if you are ab are not able <laughs> to get wood slices like this like cut, like I said you can definitely pick some of these up at Michael's. I know they have all different shapes and sizes, maybe even Hobby Lobby. I've never actually checked there but I loved how simple and easy this was and I think these are so cute and I did see this on Pinterest so this wasn't like my own idea. So there was a ton of like wood slice bunny ideas. They had a million other ones. So if you didn't like something like this, they always have many other ones. Pinterest is like super fun to go look at when you want some inspiration. And I left one of these wood slices completely brown to give it a rustic feel. But then I kind of wanted one that was white just to make it look more eastery and more colorful and more fun. And then I did end up painting the ears pink and I just used acrylic paint and then for the white I just used the white chalk paint in Waverly since I always keep that stuff on hand. I also had burlap left over from other projects and I just keep this around all the time and I just made some really simple bows and tied it with twine to keep it intact. And this was just like the easiest way to make a bow. And I just wanted to hot glue this one right onto the little brown wooden bunny. And that is all I did with this one. Like I said, this one was really, really simple. And then the other one, I just kind of folded the burlap in a couple pieces just so I could make a little simple bow for that one as well. make this one a little more fancy I just grabbed one of these pearls that I got this bag from the Dollar Tree and I just added it right to the center and like I said I did paint the middle of the ears pink because I did want some pop of color in like fun Easter bunnies but you guys that is it for the video I hope you enjoyed it and if you did like it make sure you give it a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any more of my videos and I will see you all in my next one bye Across the moon. It's kind of crowded here, but I know you see me too. Everybody's singing, oh, everybody's singing, oh.